Hello everyone, welcome to Tector.com. In this lecture, we will start studying linear algebra. So, linear algebra is basically the branch of mathematics where we study about vectors and the families of vectors, which is called vector space. So, when I was studying, I didn't study vector. So, if somebody was, I mean, if somebody is talking about vector and vector space, you might be thinking like, this is not in my course, this is not in my uh, gate syllabus. But uh, yes, the vector is basically what you study is matrix. Matrix is the representation of vectors. Okay, so in this lecture we will study matrix and the various operations over matrix. You can always expect at least two questions or uh, two questions, yes, from this chapter because this chapter is uh, like it can be considered most important chapter in linear, linear algebra section. Okay, so you have to make sure that you don't lose this marks okay so while following here everything I'll make sure that you don't lose anything I mean you don't lose any marks from this this section okay well so these are the following topics which we will be studying in this chapter so first we will start with determinant and uh, determinant because this is uh, the basics of determinant is important for understanding of uh, matrices now Next one is, see, I have an animation here for you. Whoa. Okay. So, the next one is matrix. We will study matrix and various operations of matrix li like multiplication of matrix, two matrices, what are the conditions and all those things. Now, we will come to inverse. Inverse of matrix, which is another important thing. Then, rank of matrix and what is the si physical significance of rank. Then, we will come to basis and dimension. Finally, we will go to finding out eigenvectors and eigenvalues. Basically, we will find first eigenvalues and then eigenvector. And then we will sum this chapter up with studying Kelly Hamilton theorem and its application. So, throughout the throughout this entire chapter, we will be covering various gate questions which has come in the uh, other branches also. Because, see, this mathematics is common to all the branches and this linear algebra portion, this... Uh, matrix portion is common to all the branches okay so I will try to cover everything here so I hope to see you in the next lecture and I hope you will be enjoying the upcoming lectures so see you in the next lecture thanks for watching